and Jordan has it in the corner. Jordan with another miss. No one near him. That's one he's so got to hit. What yes, sir. He hit? Oh, ah! Assistance by Andre. Great work keeping the play alive. 139 left here in the third quarter. Rose dishes to Jordan. He feeds it to Pippen. The offensive rebound, Gilmore. Nice work on the board. He's paying off with the basket. And the Bulls lead by five. And the rebound and the follow show you what he is all about. Gritty and determined with a soft touch to match. Three kicks to Curry. Curry with another miss. I'm shocked that didn't turn into three points. I mean, he makes you pay on those nearly every time. Here's Rose. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. Rose has got eight points. Really, really good at recognizing the gaps and getting the ball to the rim. Outside Curry. Kicks it to Durant. with the jumper from the elbow. Nine points in the game so far. With his size and touch, Durant has all the tools to hurt you around the rim. Pippen with it. Now Green defending. Here's the teardrop. And it's good on the way in. We've gone about three and a half minutes into the third now. Curry kicks to Durant. Green with a screen for Curry. Takes the three. And it's out of bounds. Nice touch by Curry. There's 14 seconds left in the third quarter. And Sloan kicks to Kukoc. Feeds to run. There's a good screen. It's off. And so it's the Chicago Bulls heading to the bench with a seven-point lead as we wrap up the quarter. They're playing a bruising game inside, and it's working for them. Back right after this. Now let's listen in to head coach Steve Kerr. Basically, we're going to have some fun tonight. It should be fun. It should always be fun, all right? But we're just kind of fighting ourselves still. Just continue to look to move the ball, get some kind of flow offensively. And be up down here, we'll start enjoying ourselves. Great way to look at it, Steve Kerr asking his guys to go out there and have some fun. Not every coach is going to say that. He emphasizes that. Yeah, and that's his style. I mean, he's an encouraging coach who really demands greatness. I mean, he's certainly been around enough greatness in his career to know what to look for. Welcome back. Fourth quarter action starting up. 2K Sports, happy to have you with us. It's the Splash Brothers, Curry and Clay in the backcourt. Nick Young is out there with Looney. And it's McGee in at the center, locking down the middle. That's the Warriors' five. And Young kicks to Curry. The feed to Thompson. Shot from the wing, and he nails that one right through the net. Thompson's got the first basket as we get going in the fourth for the Warriors. Now the dish to Sloan. No other screen. And Sloan kicks to Buck. Shoots over McGee. And that one's good by Butler. And the Bulls lead by seven. And it's the Warriors with the ball. Thompson outside. Curry setting the pick for Thompson. Just over a minute play here in the fourth. Let's it go from 14. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right side. Thompson has one of the sweetest strokes in the game. Chicago calls timeout.
Brandt, he's checked in for Chicago. Bang comes in for Armstrong. And let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Alden. Well, I was able to listen in to what the Bulls coach was going over with his team. He was very adamant in the huddle. He said, don't let up now. Stay aggressive and do the things that have gotten us this far. We're almost there. Guys? And that solid play in the paint continues here, guys. And Thompson kicks to Curry. That's in, coming off the assist from Thompson. Thompson always keeping his eyes up, looking for his teammates at all times. Outside, Cooper. And we're about two minutes into the fourth quarter now. Here's Butler. That one rolling around and runs out. Warriors trail by four. On outside, McGee the best to Thompson. McGee a screen, and the call is going to be, yes, yes it is, an illegal screen. Yeah, and those illegal screens have, have really become a point of emphasis for the officials. Yeah, so many of these can go either way. Very difficult for the screener to stay 100% motionless. Catching up on the changes for Golden State. Green, he's checked in for JaVale McGee. Iguodala comes in for Kavon Looney. And Kevin Durant is subbed in for Nick Young. And here's Golden State. Four-point game. Curry against Rose. Goes up to the strike. Curry shot is off. Curry's gone one of six shooting so far. Down low. Stolen by Thompson. Stolen by Pippen. Here's Rose. All on the play. Basket count. So it'll be a three-point play chance. Yeah, the whistle and then kept his focus and able to still knock it down. The free throw drops for Rose. 106 left to play here in the fourth. Green, the screen. And Thompson kicks to Kirk. And again, no good by Golden State. In this second half, the defense have been baiting him to shoot the three. And we're seeing why. Rodman with a screen on Iguodala. Here's Rose. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clear. He drops the first one, and that stretches their lead to eight. And so both free throws are good. And it's a nine-point ball game here. Well, this is how you close out. Beautiful job. Now a timeout called by Golden State. They're down by nine. 40 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And now we get the chance to present our Jordan player of the game, Derek Rose. And, and to me, the best part of his game has been the work he's done inside. I mean, slashing, driving the lane, attacking the basket at every chance. When he's had an opening, he's taken it. He's really seemed to feed off the hostile environment he's been faced with tonight. Looking at who's out there now for the Warriors. West is checked in for Green. Bell comes in for Andre Iguodala. Young's checked in for Clay Thompson. And it's Livingston in for Steph Curry. Good coach is screen on Durant. Dishes it to Armstrong. He kicks it to Slow. Down to five on the shot clock. It's a pick by Love. It's stolen by Bell. And here's the fast break. Durant leading the way. And then Durant with the top. You know, people underestimate the speed of Durant. He gets up court quickly. Armstrong with it. And so it's Chicago winning this one. This was a hard-fought, well-earned victory for him, Greg. They really had to work for this win. Yeah, that's a good point. I mean, well, weaker teams might have buckled at the end with the crowd amped up, everyone in the building kind of rooting against you. But they stood tall and, and pulled it out. Well said. And that about wraps it up. For Steve Smith, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in.